Hi, it's Deborah. I still refuse to put my makeup on. I think it's awful that us YouTubers have to make that disclaimer when we're doing videos. Oh, I don't have my face on today. Who the hell cares? Oh my God. You know, I was born like this. Why is not this way acceptable? I don't know, but I don't, these are things that bother me about YouTubers. That number one, they have to tell you they don't have their face on. Like you can't tell, oh my God. Yeah, if you can't tell I don't have my makeup on, you need to get some glasses or get your eyes fixed. Another thing that bothers me about YouTubers is when you um, click on a certain subject and you know, a lot of us do a little intro saying blah, 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 maybe for a minute or two minutes. But some of these YouTubers will go on for 15 or 20 minutes about a subject that's not even in their title. And that's why I believe they get a lot of dislikes. Also, I think if, if, you, if the YouTuber hits a nerve with you and your life, that's why a lot of us get those dislikes because we have hit a nerve with you and the subject is bothering you which is probably a good thing. Um, and a lot of YouTubers who are doing the how-tos, some of them talk so fast, you can't. You have to keep pausing it, pausing the video so you can catch up with them. Uh, almost anything you wanna know in life is on YouTube. I spend many, many hours on YouTube because I'm disabled and I, when I'm resting, I have to do something, you know what I mean? It's easier to pick up my phone than it is to turn on the TV. So, yeah, I I know a lot about a lot of things, just enough to make me look stupid. But um, let's see. Some other things I don't like about YouTubers is uh, a, a lot of them, especially Trisha Paytas and, and Jason Nash, they're famous for this. They will YouTube everything about their day. And for people who are lonely, that is wonderful. P people who don't get to get out much, that is wonderful too. But a lot of it is just banter between the two of them. And I think that's sweet because uh, you feel like you're part of their lives. And I hope that some of my subscribers feel like they're part of my life because you can't have enough friends, believe me. Yeah, and I think the YouTube society has the best following, the best uh, friendship, because a lot of these YouTubers are making a lot of money going into certain cities and having, uh, you know, their subscribers meet them. I mean, that is a big thing nowadays. And, um, of course, a lot of YouTubers make a lot of money on subject matter that is controversial. Uh, like, uh, especially people who have been in to some criminal activities. Yeah, I guess that would, uh, bring a lot of, uh, controversy. But a lot of YouTubers put on subject matter just to draw you in, and that's called clickbait. And I don't, I think I've only done it once, and I'll explain to you about my one clickbait. I put down that my house was robbed. Well, my house was robbed, but it was in Second Life. Now that is a, um, that is a YouTube game where it's surrealistic. Uh, anything you do in your real life, you can do on Second Life. And you can find it under secondlife.com. And I had a house full of furniture and someone came in and stole it all. So that was my clickbait. I put, I've been robbed, they took everything. But in the reality, it was kind of true though. But I found out that my pretend house was foreclosed on because I only get on Second Life maybe twice a year, if that much. And I hadn't updated my credit card. And of course the owners of the property in this pretend world repoed my house that doesn't exist <laughs> so I do have tomorrow off I made the mistake of asking off on tomorrow which is I guess the real Memorial Day 
you know, but I ask off Monday and tomorrow when really people celebrate Memorial Day on the Saturday and Sunday. So I've learned a lesson on that one. Uh, but I have bought some really sweet clothes for very reasonably priced. And I'm going to do a video of them. And they are so wonderful. They're just so beautiful. So, bye. Thanks for watching.